Stoney today marks a happy ending for a pup that was found abandoned in the streets of Pittston earlier this summer. That would be Nova and Newswatch 16's Chelsea Stroob was at a celebration for her today. Chelsea's live now outside our Wyoming Valley newsroom with more. Hi Chelsea. Hi, yes, that's right, John and Julie. Today was adoption day for Nova after she was found almost starving to death in the city of Pittston, but she's doing much, much better now and is being welcomed into a home that will combine her work and play in the community. All eyes were on Nova when she entered a conference room inside Pittston Police Headquarters to celebrate her adoption day. Yes, the eyes of her four-legged friends, but also those of people who remember her at her worst when she was found in June, abandoned and starving on Davis Street in the city. I had gone to the scene where she was with um, one of the officer, Lucas Savage, and it was the saddest thing I had ever seen. And from first day to now, it's the most insane improvement I've ever, could have ever dreamed of, expected, and more than physically, just mentally, emotionally, like she, amazing. Yes, it's a different story now. Now she's slated to work in the Pittston Police Department as an emotional support animal, especially for children who might be able to relate to her story. She was just depressed and um, broken. Broken. Yeah. And what is it like today to see her? It's it, I can't even describe it. Um, it's, yeah, it's been great. It's been great to see her. She's made such a great recovery. And it turns out the ones who are working hard to find justice for Nova are the ones who will be welcoming her into their home. As Pittston Police Chief Neil Murphy and his fiance, Pittston Township Police Chief Lena Angelella, signed the adoption papers and are now officially her parents. From the moment I saw the photos, uh, I became emotionally involved at that point. It was kind of hard not to be. Um, everyone was. And uh, little by little, the more contact uh, we had with her, uh, the more we knew we had to do more than just, you know, investigate the, the incident that happened with her. So Nova has some more training to do, but it's clear no matter what, the community will forever have her back. She can't walk down the street two blocks without five people cheering for her, yelling for her, wanting to meet her. It's, um, I think it's just like, especially in such a, just a darkish time, um, brought so much like joy and light to everybody. Which comes from a place where she was abandoned and, and left and discarded, and now she has all the love she could ever ask for. Nova has been in her new home for about two weeks now, and according to the chief, she's living it up. She's got her own spot on the couch, and she's loving it. But the investigation into how she ended up in this situation in the first place is still ongoing. But the chief in Pittston says he hopes to have more information for us on that front soon. Chelsea Stroob, Newswatch 16, reporting live in Luzerne County. Wow, Nova is looking great, and congrats to her and her new family. Chelsea, thanks.